Assalamu alaikum. Hope you are doing fine. We have learned how to charge an object by rubbing two materials. If you want to charge a PVC pipe, then it can be done by rubbing it to a woolen cloth or a tissue paper. There is one more method by which objects can be charged without the bringing them in contact. We call this method as electrostatic induction. To demonstrate electrostatic induction, I take one aluminum can to which I have attached a small piece of aluminum foil which is cut in this shape. I will place this on an insulating stand of this kind. Now I will charge this without the bringing this in contact with the help of this PVC pipe. See? Now to test whether the charge has accumulated or not, I bring this LCD display near to this. You can, you might have observed letters displayed on this LCD display. This shows that charges have accumulated on this uh, aluminum can. Let me repeat this once again. This shows that an object can be charged without uh, bringing in contact. We call uh, this method as electrostatic induction. Let me elaborate the concept of electrostatic induction. As I told you earlier, electrostatic induction is nothing but the process of charging an object without uh, contact. I consider one neutral metal sphere a neutral metal sphere a sphere which do not have any charge on it is referred as neutral metal sphere I am going to charge this neutral metal sphere which is uh, placed on an insulating stand this is a, an insulating stand. For the charging of this uh, sphere, I use the electrostatic induction method. Let's see what I do. For that, I bring one negatively charged rod. When a negatively charged rod is brought near this metal sphere, electrons present in this metal sphere get repelled. They move to this part of the sphere. To the opposite part of the sphere. As a result, due to electrostatic induction, same number of positive charges are produced. Here. Now next, in order to remove these electrons from the metal sphere, I ground this. Oh, when I ground this, these electrons move to the ground by leaving this metal sphere. Now only positive charges are left in the sphere. Once the electrons have moved from the metal sphere, the work of this ground grounding is over. Now I am going to remove this as well. Afterwards, this sphere have got only positive charge. These positive charges remain in its place until we hold the charged rod. The moment I remove this charged rod, you will find the these charges spreading equally in the sphere. 
now they will spread equally in the sphere. Now our metal sphere has got positively charged. We call this method of charging an object without bringing in contact as electrostatic induction. I hope uh, this video is useful. If you have any kind of doubt related to the topic, kindly put your questions in the comment section. Thanks for watching.